award-winning actress Nimi Harasgama live Can you right stop here. Saying? What? Don't keep saying award-winning. It's like geez. not an award-winning actress. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a huge deal, Nimi. I think that is something that it's a, it's a big deal because, of course, you're an award-winning actress, and we're we're obviously honored to have you on the show. Social media is something that's not something that I've been sort of involved in. I was forced to do it because of good karma. The publicity made me get a Twitter account and an Insta account, and uh, yeah, and I had no idea what to do with these things. But since Brule, I'm learning a lot. As performers, I mean, we constantly want to. To challenge ourselves and go to places that are uncomfortable, and you know, etc. You know, the reason I did Auntie Netta at the beginning was because I wasn't getting any work in England. So I started doing these online sketches and sending them to casting directors. And then they just just became popular, so I just kept doing it. And so this one theatre company commissioned me to write a one-woman show, right. and it was called Holiday for Asylum, which was part stand-up, part the experience of seeking asylum in England. A burning desire for you to work with one actor. It could be either in Hollywood or it could be either in Bollywood or wherever. Somebody that you really somehow, before you're done with your acting career, you want to actually work with that individual. Who would it be? I've all really, really, really wanted to work with Robert De Niro. Wow! He's been so much fun. Yes, I'm such a big fan of his work. Um, that would be a dream. You have to think, you know, I can do it.